So 4.2, we're looking at triangles, and it's there's some stuff you should be familiar with. So all the angles in a triangle add to 180. Okay, so remember that. We are going to look at what we call exterior angles. So that's when we have a triangle and one of the sides extends. And it could extend from any side. But that angle that it makes on the outside is called the exterior angle. And remember, it makes supplementary angles. And that means that those two, the inside and the exterior, add to 180. So I'm going to jump over here. We have a theorem. If we have an exterior angle then the remote interior or the opposite interior so not the supplementary but the other two angles if you add those other two angles so b plus c you're going to get the same degree as the exterior so this is the exterior angle and these are the inside angles added So you're, you're going to be using that. You're going to be solving for angle measures. And the last thing, you've looked at isosceles triangles. Just a reminder that an isosceles triangle has two sides that are congruent, and then the two angles on the inside are congruent. That means equal. If you cut an isosceles triangle right down the middle, you get a right triangle, actually two right triangles, that are identical. So you would have the same lengths on each right triangle. Those are isosceles. And then in one problem, you'll see a dilation that makes parallel lines. But that's the only other thing you need to know.